Okay, so I'm really excited to see what you guys have come up with in terms of dream hangers this week. I was going through some of the comments and I came across this one comment from Eweb. And uh, I think that's how you pronounce your name. Uh, Eweb has a dream hanger here, old but powerful, with the uh, nemesis, the bulwark, Hechi, Aokwang, Tia, and the kid. So, uh, yep, yeah, as you can see my hanger, we do have the nemesis here with Ivory Scourge. Here are the modules. I decided to use Overdrive Unit because, you know, one thing with the Nemesis right now, it doesn't have that much firepower. And we have a lot of bots out there with the Resistance. Um, you know, the Phantom, the Fenrir, the Falcon, um, the Leech. And I guess, uh, you know, in the case of Ravon, it doesn't really have Resistance, but it's really hard to kill. Um, so I'm wondering if this is going to help, um, you know, this build quite a bit. Um, I guess we're going to find out. Okay, so we have the uh, Bulwark here with Avengers. Here are the uh, modules, and uh, here are the skills. And I'm just going to go through this, uh, you know, really quickly here so we can jump into that first game. Uh, we have the Hetchy next with the uh, Cryo, and here are the modules and uh, skills. And this pilot helps the Hetchy quite a bit too. And then we have the uh, Alquang here with the Tyrants, and here are the modules. Uh, same thing, overdrive unit on here just to see how uh, that does. I'm kind of wondering, does it affect the uh, built-in missiles? I think that's going to be kind of interesting. And then we have the tier here. Uh, you've mentioned Blaze. I'm assuming Igniter as well. And same thing, Overdrive Unit. Want to see how it uh, works with this build. And uh, here are the skills. And then we have the kid next with machine guns. And uh, here are the modules. So uh, yeah, that's going to be my dream hanger for game number one. Let's drop into that game and let's see how we do with these bots. Okay, so we've dropped in on Dead City map. And I've uh, decided to use the Al Quang here. I wasn't sure which, uh, you know, which bot I was going to use as my beacon runner. Got to make sure we get this beacon here first. Uh, so important. Just looking to see who on my team is on this side. Um, so if they attack here, I'm going to be all alone. I'm just going to try to hold this down here. I do have last stand, so I'm hoping that my teammate uh, drops in here. So what actually happened was, uh, you see my teammates, they kind of were all clustering around this area. Quite often when I play... I would say about 80-90% of my solo games, they never watch this right beacon, which is so important, uh, you know, on this map. Uh, you know, most of the games that you end up actually losing is because you give up this side beacon. He's gonna blink behind me, yep. But I did get him really good, so he, and also right now is the best time to attack. So we're gonna move on over to uh, this side here. Because I know he doesn't, he uses his ability, so he doesn't have that resistance. There we go. This guy's flying. He's flying above me here. He's gone into a uh, phase shift as well. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, perfect. Trying to help out my buddy here. He's gone into a phase shift. we go rampage you know this build is actually pretty decent um, I've run a few games now and I've actually done pretty pretty good with it I actually have a few uh, or I have had a few godlikes rather speaking of which <laughs> just like that and this guy what is he in ah.
That was a pretty good run there with the Hetchy. Uh, let's drop in with the Bulwark next. Let's move this way. Go for this guy. Gotta use the uh, shield here. Wait a minute. We only have three players left. What's going on here? Um, I'm just looking to see who drops in here. You serious, right? <laughs> only four players. My teammates may want to uh, slow things down a bit. Only two players? Are you kidding? Guys? <laughs> It's not going to be two versus five, is it? Okay, we got three. His uh, last stand has triggered. Let's take this guy out. Uh oh. What is this? What is that? Is that the. Uh Trying to see if is that the kid or what? I'll use my uh, shield yep to alternate it. Let's deal with this guy if I can. Ah. Yeah, we got to be careful. Oh, they actually got our right beacon here. Um, let's use the tier. I wonder if I'm gonna be able to uh, sneak by and take this uh, beacon here. I'm gonna try to be sneaky. It's three versus four. This game's actually pretty intense. Is he gonna drop in here? I hope not. Okay, we're getting this beacon. That's good. Is that a uh, behemoth? Behemoth. Uh... Oh wait, he killed his bot. Let's try to get this guy here. This guy and this one here. Uh oh. Trying to heal up here. I'm gonna have to deal with this guy. Come on. Yes. This guy here. Yes. And this one. Maybe. Maybe. Ah. Uh, let's drop in with the uh, kid. Let's do this. Melt this guy up. Yeah, run. 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 <laughs> He's trying to go for the other beacon. I'm trying to stop him. Ah, oh, shoot. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, come on. You ever seen uh, <laughs> the kid chase after a leech? I think we should go for... Yeah, we're going to go for that beacon. I still have my nemesis, but we are down to 4 versus 3 here. I'm going to try to stop this guy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Yes. But I think he he's probably going to drop in here, right? He has another bot. Let's try to burn this guy up. Let's try to get this beacon. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Okay, I'm gonna kill this now because we still have one bot left. And I really want to use all the bots in my hangar here. Let's go for that guy. I don't want to use phase shift. The game's almost over. Okay, so that was a really good run there with this uh, hangar. 
And uh, let's take a look to see how we did. And uh, let me just close this. Okay, so we did uh, 2.5 million, 11 kills, 3 beacons in this game. And I think we were down a player here looking at uh, this guy. And uh, let's take a look at uh, this player from Gods. And this guy's probably running everything maxed out. No, he isn't. He's using a level 34 Arthur here. So uh, this is what he's running. And let's take a look at uh, the other team. So I think, yeah, both of these players are from iOS. So I can't see their hanger. And this one here is from Android. And this is what he's running. And before we take a look at the next dream hanger, let's take a look at the honor points for this game. Okay, so uh, yep, we're going to take a look at the next dream hanger coming from I Love Cats. Wait a minute, is this Ben Kitty WR trolling me? <laughs> this is the first thing that came to my mind when I saw this comment. Um, but yeah, if you guys don't know about uh, Ben, he has a YouTube channel as well. And his videos always have this theme um, where he has a cat in there somewhere. But anyways, uh, yep, so I Love Cats wants a super suppressor dream hanger with the Blitz, Invader, Raker, Cerberus, Nightingale, and the Nodens, I'm going to go ahead and build that hangar and then show you what I have in terms of pilot skills and modules before we launch into game number two. Okay, so um, yep, we're going to take a look at this hangar here. We have the Blitz with Rhyme and uh, here are the modules. And I am going to be running the Legendary Pilot for the Blitz. Uh, this pilot actually gives it uh, resistance, kind of like the Leech, um, except you lose your Aegis Shield. So I'm not going to have an Aegis Shield, but I'm going to have a lot of resistance and uh, you know this pilot actually makes the blitz really strong so if you have a blitz um, i would be looking forward to that pilot i think it's coming in the next operations uh, next up we have the invader here with atomizer and quarker here are the modules and you know what i'm kind of curious to see you know how this does as well because i think this build could actually be really good um, now that we don't have you know uh, the shotguns with uh, corona and halo i think this could be a really good substitute and uh, we have uh, the Ray Connects with Avenger and Shredder. Here are the modules. I have Overdrive Unit on here as well. And uh, here are the skills. And then we have the uh, Cerberus with the uh, Igniter and uh, the Ember. And uh, here are the modules and the skills. And then we have the Nightingale with the uh, Pilot along with the Scourge and Spark. And uh, here are the modules and skills. And then lastly the Titan Nodens. So we have uh, the Nodens here with Cyclone. And uh, this time around I'm going to actually use two Antimatters with two Plate Armor uh, on here. So yep, that's going to be my lineup for game number two. Let's hop into that game and let's see how we do with these bots. Okay, so game two we have dropped in on Shenzhen map and I've decided to actually start with the Raker. I'm gonna get this guy, I'm trying to move out of this uh, Phantom's way here. Come on dude, ah! Oh! <laughs> That's the only thing about uh, the spider bots, you get in front of everyone and then you block them. I wonder if this guy can uh, make his way onto this beacon here. This uh, Ao Jung made a terrible mistake there. So now he's going to lose his beacon and he's not getting it back. There's no ways I'm going to give it back to him. Let's hit him again. Just constant suppression here. And again. There we go. This bot really is creepy. <laughs> it's also probably the best bot when it comes to dealing with something like a Loki too. Because it's so low to the ground. Oh jeez, this guy did not know I was here. Okay, we're on their home beacon here. And, whoa, what's going on at home? Um, you know what? I'm going to use the invader here. Let's 
get this guy. So you see what I'm doing is I'm moving onto this beacon to defend it here. Let's just maybe suppress this guy. Oh jeez, he's getting hit by four of us, five of us. I think it was a bit overkill there. Oh man, they got the right beacon. Uh-oh. I don't know if that's a good thing. That's actually a really bad thing. <laughs> but you know what? It makes the game more exciting. Let's get this guy. You know this build, I've run for a few games now and this invader build is actually pretty solid. So if you have an invader and you're thinking of a build for it, you know, this is the one I really recommend. He's going to drop in over here, I think. Nope. Let's get this guy. Uh oh, here come the titans. Just gonna suppress. Let's get this Ares. Oh jeez. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> I'm trying to take out as many guys as possible here. Oh jeez. Can I suppress this guy? Ah, shoot. I try to suppress him. Whoa, they got the right side. Um, you know what? Let's use a Cerberus. Uh-oh. That was a nut shot right there. Trying to melt him up with my Cerberus here. Oh, nut shot. That's going to do it though. Yes, we got him. Jeez, look at, look at how crazy it is over here. Um, you know what? I'm going to use the Blitz next. I think I got this guy with Suppression here. Jeez. That guy, that guy was going all, <laughs> he was going all psycho on us. Let's move this way. Um, what does this guy have? Gonna wait until I have all my rockets charged up here. And then go for this guy. Ah! Ah! <laughs> yeah, that that that's pretty that's a pretty strong uh, Titan there. Oh jeez, that's got to be a max starter uh, after that. I'm waiting for my next attack here. I think someone suppressed him with a nodens or something. Yeah. guy's healing me up yes although I'm almost out here ah. um, you know what she wait what's going on over here we got to get onto this beacon quick I'm trying to heal up my uh, teammate while suppressing uh, this guy let's fly this side We need to uh, protect that beacon there, guys. Let's try to get this beacon. Oh, shoot. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was bad timing. But you know what? I might be able to get this still. Suppress this guy. Suppress that guy. 
And uh, maybe try to get this beacon would be good. Wait, is he going to drop in over here or what? Let's work away at this guy here. Uh-oh. <laughs> this guy was getting me when I wasn't looking there. Oh, shoot. Whoa, look at my health. Man, this is down... Like, it's three versus three. This is legit game here. Yeah, he's gonna get me. There's no ways I can escape this. I'm trying to help my teammate back there. And we're now down to the final uh, bot, which is my Titan. Oh, jeez. Trying to burn up this guy. There we go. Um, let's get this guy. Uh oh. Trying to heal up my uh, teammate here. <laughs> you know what? I wonder if I can actually take this beacon here. I'm trying to heal up here. I actually need to. I need to uh, reload. But he's gonna give me this beacon, which is good. Um, I wonder if I can get this guy. We have four beacons. I think that's gonna be. Should be enough. It's two versus two, though. Suppress this guy. Get inside his bubble. Turn him into noodles. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no, come on. It's two versus one. Where is my teammate? There we go. There we go. This guy's gonna be turned into noodles too. Uh oh, uh oh. Does he have another bot left? No, he does. Oh shoot. Holy crap, that was a pretty intense game. <laughs> um, let's take a look to see how we did here in this game. Um, I hope we don't crash. Uh, let's take a look here. So 4.5 million. Let me just close this window. So 4.5 million, 7 kills, 6 beacons. That was one heck of a game. Look at the scores. Everyone is over 1 million. Um, let's take a look at my uh, teammate here. And uh, this player running the following hangar, level 39 kid. And uh, let's take a look at the other team. Uh, this player here is on iOS. Uh, this one's on Android. And this is what he's running, level 42 Ao Ming. And before we end things, the uh, honor points for that game. Okay, so here's the honor points for that game. And that's pretty much it. So thank you very much to Ewab and to Cats for your dream hangers. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay of them. And to everyone else, if you would like a chance to be featured in a future dream hanger video, make sure to post your dream hangers in the comment section down below. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.